Jamaica's Asafa Powell has run one of the quickest times this season, but along with four other of the island's athletes, he's failed tests for banned substances. The small Caribbean nation that's a sprinting superpower has prided itself on being clean and drug-free, but now its reputation is on the line. Sharon Simpson, who won a gold in the 4x100 meter relay at the Olympics in Athens and silvers at Beijing and London, also tested positive. The rivalry between Jamaica and the US is fierce, but they too had shock news. The American Tyson Gay had recorded the fastest time over 100 metres this year. Impressive after coming back from injury, but his positive tests could see his preparation for the World Championships count for nothing after this result. Sometimes when you get to that part of your career, the, the, you know, the second part of your career, maybe a hint of desperation comes in and you start looking for other things. Whether he has done it, as he said, of his own volition or whether it's been someone in his camp who's, um, who's sent him down that path, it's, it's absolutely the wrong path to go down. Powell, Simpson and Gay have all issued statements admitting they've unintentionally taken banned substances. Questions are being asked about what these results mean to athletics and the world of sprinting. Nick Davis, BBC News, Kingston, Jamaica.